Fatty, what is it? If you know anything at all, I urge you to share it with me. You want to tell me, but you can't? Hmm, I understand. I'm sure you have good reason for keeping quiet. Like I'm, I'm been doing some thinking on this since we last spoke. You have had this destiny thrust upon you without warning or choice, for that matter. But I wish to help you as the best I can. I'm getting older and I lack the vigor of youth, but even older men have ways of being useful too. I wish to share as much of my knowledge with you as you can. If you have any questions, any questions at all about Skyloft 3, I'll be glad to help tell you all I know. Actually, what do I know of the Triforce? Link, where did you hear that word? It's true that the ancient texts make several mentions of the Triforce within their pages. Unfortunately, the actual location of the Triforce isn't illuminated in any of those tomes. Its whereabouts are lost to history. Sorry, Link, it changed me to say about my knowledge is of little use on this subject. Well then, what good are ya? What do I do now? This is like the only guy I could think of to talk to. Hey. Link, just a moment. Um? Though there is one, one whose vast knowledge may be of use. Surely you're familiar with Levias, the great sky spirit who has guarded our realm for ages. Levias has served the protector of our skies for a long time, and his knowledge of our world is encyclopedic, to put it mildly. If anyone in the entirety of Skyloft and beyond were to know about the Triforce, it would be him. Where is he, and why have I never heard of him before? I fear that might be your next question. About that. Imagine in your travels you've taken notice of the tremendous thunderhead that has suddenly appeared in our skies. Oh, the big orb thing. Recently, I've heard rumors suggesting that Levias is trapped inside that massive cloud. I asked Instructor Allen to look into this trembling, troubling cloud in order to determine if there is any truth to these rumors. I had meant to inquire about his findings earlier, but I completely forgot about it until after Zelda missing. Instructor Allen can fill me in on the details later, so why don't you go speak with him yourself and see what his investigation has revealed. Thank you for the information! So who's Allen? Mr. Ceiling Guy or the other one? He's this guy. Mm. He's not Mr. Ceiling Guy, he's the other one. Oh, Link, how goes your search for Zelda? Have you found her yet? What? Levias, oh, so you've been talking to the Headmaster, I take it. If I'm correct, Levias is the one inside the Thunderhead, but that's not the Le Levias that we all know. That's... a monster! It certainly looks like Levias, but last time I approached him, he came rushing at me, and his eyes... They were full of malice. People change, or old, wizened creatures change, but rather. Perhaps it's more than that. He's possessed by something. That's how it felt to me. What? You want to talk to Levias? That's impossible. I don't think Levias is capable of listening. Not in his current state, no. And even if you were to get close enough to talk to him, it would likely end with you getting brushed aside and sent flying to your death in a sea of clouds. What? You're still planning on going? I see. It's because you need to find Zelda. I understand. I get the feeling nothing I could say would talk you out of it. Hey, I have an idea. Come with me. We'll go and see a place called Candied Island. Hey! Levius is inside the Thunderhead. He's been acting so strangely, like something has possessed him. If we can somehow free him from whatever it is that has a hold over him, then there's a chance he will return to his senses. Listen well, Link, because I'm about to teach you a very powerful bird riding technique. It's called the Spiral Charge. Using the Spiral Charge, you can rid Levios of the blight that has hold of him. The technique is quite easy to perform. All you have to do is press A. However, the acceleration effect lasts longer than any attack move you've used so far. Maintaining stable flight can be tricky. This is a technique that only Senior Knight Academy students who have mastered high-level flight skills are allowed to perform. It's a little bit too early for you, but this is an extraordinary circumstance, so I'll make an exception this time. However, I will test you. First, dive off this platform and call your bird. Crimsy, I have need of you! Oh, been a long time since we heard this music. Listen up, Link. I thought your boss wing to, to perform a spiral charge when you press A. 
Press A to spiral charge and break the 10 targets placed around the floating bo boulders up ahead. If you can destroy 10 targets in under 120 seconds, I will re recognize you as a skilled bird rider. Alright, off you go. This is gonna be terrible! This is gonna be absolutely terrible! Ah! One. Ah! That's two. Oh my god, I'm so bad at riding the bird though! I'm gonna need to get... Okay, got that one. Oh god, the moving ones are gonna be terrible. They're gonna be the death of me. Okay, fly upwards, why don't you, Crimsy? This is gonna be terrible! I've gotten three and I have half seconds remaining. Okay, that's one more. Take that one down. Moving one! Going for a moving one! Bam! Alright. Bam! What?! Ow! Crimsy! You hit the wall! Do you like screwing me over, Cr Crimsy? No! I could have done it, Crimsy! I could have done it! But then you had to do this! You didn't have to do this! You had to do this, didn't you, Crimsy? Right now. <laughs> you better work with me. You better work with me. I don't even want... I don't even want... Master Dora, it's destroy 10 targets within the time limit. If you can control your bird that well, you'll have no problems at all. I knew you could do it, Link. And what a magnificent red bird do. You are henceforth permitted to use the spiral charge attack as a qualified bird rider. The next thing we have to do is just how to go about finding us. Maybe the owner of the Plumpy Lumpkin might know something. Every year he makes an offering of his pumpkin soup for Livias. Uh, I'll meet you at the Plumpy Lumpkin! Okay, so there was a uh, goddess cube on this island. I remember that. Because this is Bamboo Island or something. But this is the one from the Elden Volcano, and wow. That's the one from the Elden Volcano that I got. I'd look into this island, but yeah, I I'll, I'll guess I'll sneak a peek into what's in here.
Boing Ling. You can get a valuable treasure if you seek, succeed in cutting the bamboo stalk over 28 times a clean cut. Yo. Is that you, Link? What is this place? Not the end book. He's dressed. I have no idea who you are. Um... <laughs> At least it's fast growing. Okay, I want to do that better. Let's do that. I can't do spin attacks this time. Let's not do any spin attacks. Why do you have an evil crystal? Game. 
my voice hurts. What's the matter? You look like you've got something mighty serious on your side. Livias, what about him? Sure, I know Olivia's well, but I wasn't aware anything was wrong. Every year I offer him an entire basin full of my pumpkin soup. But lately a huge thunderhead has been brewing there, and I haven't yet made this year's offering. I tell you, I feel horrible about it. No. You, you say you'll deliver a bottle of my soup to Livias? Huh, I don't know how you plan to find that huge thunderhead brewing out there, but... If that's the case, I'm going to do everything I can to make Levias the best batch, the best batch of soup ever. You, walk right, you wait right there, I'm getting inspired to fire up some soup like I've never souped before. Voila! Here it is. Been cooking this stuff for well over ten years, and I have to say that this is the best batch of pumpkin soup I have ever created. I will signif signal for the robot. Miss Fee, I'm here! <sighs> My voice really hurts after that last out outburst. But... <sighs> it is a Oh, well, this is another heavy load, but don't worry, I can carry anything. I'll be waiting outside, I can take you wherever you need to go as soon as you're ready. How's he gonna get it outside? Mm. The place where I offered soup to Levias is inside the Thunderhead Cloud on an island with everlasting rainbow! I've seen that place before! Let's go rainbow it up, shall we? This last episode might need to be cut a bit short because parents are bugging me about stuff, so. What do you want? Hi! No, you're not welcome. No idea. Aww. Yep, I'm, I'm perfectly fine with it. See ya! So, we're going to the Thunderhead. Yes, right. Thunderhead. That's over there. Yeah. So far, grr. I guess I'll speed up until then. 